Hello, I'm Expired Alphabets, and we're playing Nier Automata. We're looking for some missing Yoru units. Their circuits are fried. I think they were only being kept alive by that enemy. Oh. Oh, dang. They're, they're being kept alive. Oh, that's freaky. So they were alive that whole time. When I was fighting them, I was killing them. Oh, that's... Ugh, that's gross. Ugh, what a weird... So, uh, what a weird enemy. What is it? That machine had some pretty weird things to say, huh? It's almost yeah. like it had actual emotion. The machines don't have feelings. You said that yourself. Yeah, I... I guess. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I did say that. Thanks for using my words against me. All right. Well, now we get to leave the amusement park. Hot dials. Hostiles. Bow, bow, bow. Huh? Yeah. This thing is I would like a thank you. Sure, I'll go to the village. Could be a trap. Still, we should at least head over there and gather data, right? Yeah, I guess traps are a form of data. Ooh. <laughs> I just I can't I just can't help it. Precious earrings! Oh yeah. That's not the way to this item over here. This way is the way to the item. Amber! Find some find a mosquito in that. Use it use it to find uh dinosaur DNA. Ooh, 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 more shit! Uh, 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 200 gold! 200 G! Actually, they don't use gold as a unit of measurement here. They use, like, machine parts, and they call it a G. Like, they're, like, <laughs> there's actually a joke, like, what, what, like, what does G stand for? He's like, that's classified. But we're gonna go. We're gonna follow this guy. Uh, not, not hard to find. I, I know, dude! There's one road. Oh, right. You wouldn't have seen that before. They're sending supplies up from Earth to the moon in the bunker. There are no spare parts or fuel in space, after all. Yeah. Yeah, believe it or not, there's no uh, coal on the moon. No, uh, no fossil fuels. I know it's it's trippy to think about. Whoops. Ah! Uh, I fell. All right. They originally came here from well, outer space, right? <laughs> well, there it turns out okay. Theories about that, but no one knows for sure. Ooh. Wait, dude. Tell what an alien is thinking, you know? Yeah, range defense up, L. Yeah, you can't tell what a machine ask, is ask is uh, thinking. If only you could ask them. Oh, look at that! It's the white flag of peace. They want peace. It's a machine village. It's <laughs> so weird. They all have white flags. Looks like they really don't want to fight. Hello. Hello. To be. Hmm. We can't trust anything the machines say. Kill them. I understand that you see us as the enemy. I'm not sure who we're supposed to ask. The white flag means we surrender. Yeah. Please be calm. We are not your enemy. Pascal. You know, we already have something of a relationship with you androids. In fact, I'm hoping you can take this to Anemone in the resistance camp. What is it? It's a fuel filter that she requested. If you take it to her, it should make it clear that we're a peaceful group. Alright. I don't know how they decide what they're going like what text they're going to give voices for and what text they won't like it 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 feels to me almost like oh shit i have to run back eventually i'll unlock fast travel but 
Yeah, I have to run back. Is there a way back? Um, oh yeah, there is a fast way back. Okay. Uh, it's not fast travel, but it's like a shortcut. Um, yeah, it feels to me like they, they had the scripts all written out and they recorded voices for it. But, here, but they, uh, like, as they were, like, writing it and, like, making the game, they realized, I think I have one, they realized, like, it doesn't flow very well, so they added in new dialogue, just, like, at the last minute, yeah, so, with this one, with this, like, set, uh, I just, I just got a bunch of movement speed shit, just so that I run faster. Uh, I run, like, 4% faster now. <laughs> Which, I don't know, I don't know how much, uh, how big of a difference that makes. When I have to run all the way back to, to, uh, the resistance camp. Thanks. Yeah, so it feels like they just added, like, a bunch of dialogue last minute and just didn't have the chance to re to, like, record it. Hopefully in, like, a future patch, they'll, they'll re-record all that stuff. Definitely not the person to discuss this with. <laughs> I don't think I can stand spending one more day in this bunker. You leaving would be bad for me. It would affect mission efficiency. Uh, uh, are you saying you need me to be? All Model B combat units require the assistance of an operator. Stand here until this conversation's done. So, I think I ran too fast. <laughs> That's all. Closing this channel. <laughs> it's weird that the androids would also have, like, such emotions and such intense emotions. Like, like to actually, like, try and, like, fall in love with each other and shit. Alright, this is 9S. Say, Anemone, I've got a package for you from a, from a machine called Pascal. Anemone, uh... A fuel filter? Ah, perfect timing. We were running low. Wait, you meant Pascal? Sure did. So you've been consorting with machines, huh? Oh, jeez. That is quite an accusation. Just the ones in the village. They're totally harmless, and they also have the means to construct intricate devices that we can't. In exchange, we provide them with oil and other materials. I guess you'd call it a form of commerce. I see. Anyway, if you're headed back there, please take this high viscosity oil to Pascal. Viscous oil. Alright. Yeah, uh, I'm definitely gonna do that on account of that's, uh, like, the fucking main quest line. I have a little shopping to do. Um, shouldn't be too much. What are you buying? I'm gonna buy some heels. I got to buy some heels. 11 of these, please. Thank you, sir. Um, and he doesn't have... He doesn't... Oh, weapon attack up. <gasps> I want that. I want some of that. Come back soon. Sure. Let's see. Talk to the shop person. Buy some plus eight storage. 10,000 gold. Ah, it costs too much. Cost too much. I can't buy it. I can't buy anything. It's not worth it to try to buy the uh oh the upgrades if what do you think? if I don't have the room for it. Transmitting to us directly. Now do you believe we're not a threat? Your mouth can say anything it wants, but you still don't. I don't have a mouth. I just have a speakers. Technically accurate. Yes. Well, you're free to visit our village whenever you like. 
I'm gonna come right now. I'm gonna come right now! Don't hang up on me! Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's that's one thing I found that's pretty cool about this game is is like their their like upgrade system is you get to is it, it's it's like you get to choose which is normal RPG shit, but it's it's like the way that you get to choose instead of just being like ooh you know wave your hands you get and. You get attack upgrade, woo, spooky magic. It's like, oh, it's a plug-in chip. It's, it's like software or hardware or whatever that like it ma makes you deal like more damage, right? Like a computer with a graphics card. Like, oh, you can choose which graphics card you want. And then you have to buy like slots, right? It's like, oh, you have to buy like, yeah, you could have two graphics cards if you want, but you have to buy the extra graphics card slot. And then you have to buy the graphics card. And it's, I don't know, it's interesting. Um, like this guy also has some stuff. This guy's a weapon stealer. But he has, what is pretty cool is, uh, these. I'm gonna get... I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get this axe. Oh, I don't have enough money. At some point, I'll buy that axe. Because it's pretty sweet. And this guy... This guy sells upgrade chips, too. So, so kind of funny, he's like, You were consorting with machines? And it's like, I'm gonna... If, if consorting just means, uh... Buy shit from them, then yeah, I'm gonna do that. This guy doesn't have anything I want, either. Cool, man. Uh, Pascal's up there. All right, let's go. Hup. I love that jumping up the ladder. Come on, stop. Oh, you brought me some high viscosity oil. Anemone is just so kind and understanding. <clears throat> if only all androids and machines could live together in peace like this. Never gonna happen. I guess not. I'd appreciate it if you could help out some of the other machines as well, though. But is that my quest now? <laughs> like, like they recorded that line. <laughs> what the hell was that? What's that noise? Doobie, this is an emergency transmission from the bunker. We're reading the highest class enemy inside the city ruins, and it looks like there are a ton of other machines there with it. All your high units should proceed and engage immediately. But Goliath, this was a trap. I knew it. <laughs> Let me save. I it's like someone texting from across the room. Let's <laughs> go. It's like I'm just down here. No, I'll t I'll send you a message. I'll just call you. So <laughs> like, I could just come back up the ladder. Nah, don't don't worry about it. <laughs> come on, go. All right, we're gonna go fight a Goliath class. Uh, machine. I saved, right? I don't even remember. I'm pretty sure I saved. If I didn't, then... That's okay. Bad things will happen. But that's alright. We're just gonna go fight the Goliath class dude. I need to change my, uh... Plug-in chips back. Yes, yeah, you have no room. Alright. Command is deploying new flight units for us. They just set the coordinates, so let's get going. Okay. Oh, actually, I do want, I do want the movement speed back. Cause I'm not gonna fight the dude. I'm actually just gonna. Shit, I'm dumb. Whatever. Fuck it. Here we go. <laughs> do you see? Do you see my four percent faster? <laughs> it's such a big difference. You can totally tell. Also, it's all black and white now, which is neat, but, um, makes it hard to see. But that's okay. That's okay, there are all these red, uh, fireflies around. Or whatever they are. I don't know if that's a type of insect that actually exists or not. Or what it is? I don't know. I don't know what that's supposed to be. Spores? 
Is there a type of fungus spore that like glows in the dark? Oh, that'd be so cool. Oh, that'd be super cool! Because then you can see where all the fungus is and stop it from getting you. So here's this Goliath. It's pretty fucking big. Ooh, there's an item. I'm gonna go under the arch of his foot to get the item. Get the item. Yeah. Amber. Worth it. Woo! Alright. <laughs> uh, it is inside, I believe, this building here. So, we're gonna... We're gonna climb up these stairs and go get the flight units and then fight that Goliath next time on the show! Thanks for watching. Bye.